Hello, my name is Ardi and we are going to solve practice exercise 3.1 from Morris Manu book. So the question is simplify the Boolean function f x y z of the sigma 0, 1, 6, and 7. Okay, we have a three function logic here. I mean three variable logic here. So we need a K map with three variables. So let's draw the K map first. Usually I draw it with X, Y here and then the Z there. Okay. And the X, Y will use the zero, 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 one and then one one and then one zero and for z we will have zero and okay now let's let's fill out the sigma here the index of zero one six and seven will be one in this gamut okay now let's exactly do that zero in three bit binary is triple zero so we'll have zero 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 so we put one here this is for this one and then for one we have zero zero one as the binary representation of one so zero zero one is one here that is for the one okay now for six remember that six is one one zero six is one one zero so one one zero we will have one in this place here so we have placed this six in the place so now we will have seven here remember that seven is one 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 so we will have one 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 here and the rest we will fill it with zero so we'll have zero and we will have zero and we will have zero and we will have zero okay now we can circle which one the one that is adjacent in a group of two four or eight okay we have a group of two a group of one here i think yeah i have this group of one here okay and we also have a group of one here. Okay, let's see the first circle here that I highlight with yellow, this one. Okay, now we have Z here is zero and one. So that is different for, for the two one. So we don't care about the Z. We only care about the X and Y and if we see here our x and y here is zero and zero so we will have the first function here because that is zero and zero meaning that we have x naught and y naught okay and now let's see the second circle which i will color it here in green okay now let's see we have a different z here zero and one so again we don't care about the z we only care about the x and y okay now because x and y is one one so we don't need the not part here so we'll have x and y okay and that is the boolean function that we are looking for And I think I did not make any mistakes. Yeah, this is just the order. The book given the ye the green part first and then the yellow part first. But addition is commutative, so this is not a problem. And I think that's all for practice exercise 3.1 from Morris and Manu book. Let me know if you have any question and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.